When I first came to Hilltop Road, I was a mum here, um, completely new to the area, had no family here, um, and was really, really lost. I had a background of being, um, like, with solitude myself, like I would just stand back. We had just moved over from New Zealand, and it was kind of, I felt lonely as in my daughter was going to school, but the, their school was a little bit closed off from parents. You had to leave as soon as the bell rings in the morning. But when we came to Hilltop, to know that we can come to school and we have our own little family of friends. Community engagement is incredibly important. When we first came to Hilltop Road, it wasn't a main feature of the culture within the school. There was a little bit of an us and them mentality and it really showed through in our students um, and our relationships with our parents and the community. And it really was impacting on learning. Students that feel safe and secure and supported will learn. Students who do not feel safe and secure will struggle to learn because they have so many other things on their mind, they can't focus. They've come from home in the morning and um, we need to consider the well-being of the families that they've left and how we can support them. We don't just take the child through the gate of a day, we, we take in the whole family. Whenever I just see my mum or my dad walking in the playground, I can just go over to them and have a chat. It makes me feel happy because I know if like I get her, I can always go to her. Our community is very diverse here at Hilltop Road. We've got families from across the world. Um, we've got families that are newly arrived. We've got families that have been settled here for a while. We've got lots of families that are really isolated in the community. And then coming to playgroup was like, well, like heaven <laughs> for mummy to meet new new mums. Being away from you know just being away from home and coming to school, we're able to just make a nice bond. It began really with um, one thing that we found that was really successful was a Ready, Set, Go transition program. It was a great platform to actually welcome families in 20 weeks before they come to school the previous year and build that rapport and relationship with them. So before they've even actually enrolled at our school, we've already welcomed that family in and you've already got a really strong connection to that family. Ready, Set, Go definitely helped me as I was very much not ready for my first to go to big school. You know, you want to hang on to your babies. Um, it helped me in building a social network and feeling part of the school community, you know, six months before actually starting school. So our community engagement strategies is really looking at um, all the different groups of, of, of people that we have in our school and how we can best meet their needs. Rather than saying, this is what we have to offer, so do you want to take um, up some of these offerings? We've actually gone to our community and said, what is it that you need around learning for yourself as a learner? What do you need in terms of supporting your child here as a learner in our school? And how can you be part of the everyday um, existence here in our school? If it's through Seesaw, you know, being able to see what your child's doing. If it's pop-up cafes. If it's being able to support with a home reading program. If it's through a learning opportunity as an adult. We might have like TAFE New South Wales come in to approach parents that, that want to learn how to get a job or how to do resumes or how to improve their life. We might teach them how to swim, we might teach them how to drive. So it could be something along the lines of we, we're running a computer workshop and suddenly the mums are no longer in their daggy jeans and their t-shirts. They've come business dressed, they've got their jacket on, they've come dressed, they've put makeup on. Um, yeah, I did a certificate three then in traineeship, then I um, did a diploma and now I'm working there <laughs> at Cumberland Council for Children's Services. And the impact that that has had on directly on their children and their education because they see their, their mum becoming empowered and taking care of themselves and having goals and that's bringing their children up as well because they want to be like them as well. Children are really feeling a sense of joy when they see their parents here as learners and learning and participating in workshops and that's sending, in my opinion, a really strong message around the value of learning and the joy in learning. I think that they have learning not only in the classroom but they're learning everywhere throughout the school. People get to know your parents better and you get to like see them, how they act around other people and saying that sounds really weird but it's true they uh, get a better understanding of what community is themselves, they feel a part of something bigger than themselves and they feel a sense of belonging. Even if you just read your 
a, a book to the children in the classroom, it gives them pride when they, when they see their parents here. Well, in terms of um, how do we gauge our success, we look at what the data is telling us at that given time, um, and that could be attendance at workshops, it could be anecdotal information when we're talking to people around um, the workshops that they've participated in or where they want to head with something. And we also it really capture the, um, our parents around the success and the skills that they have. We know they've got lots to give. I love to help in any kind of way to help our school, help the students, help Miss Catherine. She has a lot of ideas and I kind of like bring that idea to life. What, one of the things that comes across is that um, our school community makes them feel valued, that they've got a purpose. Being a stay-at-home mum for the last couple of years and to continue to be for a, for a little bit longer, um, I feel like it just gives me a little bit more, uh, not to put myself down in general, but a little bit more worth. It gives me some tasks to do other than just home duties, um, but confidence. We need to learn as schools that we're not just here for one purpose. Community engagement should just be up there with maths and English and science, it should just be a given in a school. Uh, there's a sense of joy and being proud around the fact that I'm part of this story, that we've been able to see the transformation. And to be honest, our teachers don't come and go, they stay because they want to be part of this story. You do things on a day-to-day -day basis but you don't realise how it's impacting people. It can be such a small difference or a big difference but it's making a difference. I think this is definitely a happy school. Yeah, I call it home away from home.